Jackson Boxer and you're joining me at my restaurant Brunswick House where I've been playing around with the amazing Shirigiku vinegar sent to me by Miskan. Um, what I've done is I've used it to make a little fried haddock and chips. The haddock uh, has been deep fried in a light tempura batter uh, and then dressed with sour cream and then trout roe which I've washed in the Shirigiku just to flavor it and sharpen it up. Uh, and finally I'm finishing it off with a whirl of matchstick potatoes which have been spritzed with the vinegar just to give them that amazing chip shop acidity. So now that you've seen it, I'm gonna show you how to make it. We have some beautiful baby haddock. This was sent down to me from Peterhead in Scotland um, and they're lovely small pearlescent spanking fish. So the fish goes into the flour, we knock it off to remove any excess flour and then it goes into the, the slurry and then we're just going to drop it into the fry. So after a couple of minutes we've got this beautiful crisp crust. We're just going to lift it out and shake it off on the tray to remove the excess oil and then dress it. Okay, so here we have our fish. We're just gonna garnish it um, before we pop it in our, 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 on the plate. The, the garnish that we're gonna use, I've got some sour cream, which we're just gonna pipe on top of the fish. And then I've got some trout roe, which I've, I'm gonna wash in a really delicious little dressing made from shirigiku uh, with a bit of honteri, uh, some white soy, and some lemon juice, which will just nicely acidulate the little eggs uh, and just give them a beautiful popping sharpness. Uh, trout eggs are absolutely delicious, but they're very, very rich and oily. And I find just washing them in the shirigiku vinegar gives them this amazing complexity. Next, I'm gonna finish our fried fish with some matchstick chips. These are English potatoes, which have been sliced using a Japanese mandolin, very, very fine. Um, and then deep fried gently in, in oil till they go super crisp and very sweet. All the natural sugars of the potatoes just caramelize and they're sweet and crunchy and perfectly crisp. As a final touch, that authentic English fish and chip shop, salt and vinegar flavor. The salt is already there uh, from the fish eggs. The extra element of vinegar, we're gonna add with a spray bottle of shirigiku. Uh, which is an absolutely delicious rice-based vinegar, uh, commonly used in all the top Japanese sushi restaurants. Um, and I'm going to use it just to dress the fried potatoes. Done. 